like to see when I'm ready to stream That game link can take me away Driving the car or fighting that creature of the night like a dream Take me away, I'm in a fantasy stream In the game that is so extreme Racing my mind, Ashton streams for all time Cause baby she's ready to stream I'm turning the PlayStation off Wednesday, I lost my headphones, uh, put them down and I, they became invisible to me. Sorry about that, I couldn't find my headphones. Hello everyone, how's everyone doing? Is everyone okay? I'm a bit frazzled for some reason. I feel well frazzled, but hopefully um, I've not even got to yeah. shut up. Hello Ashton, how are you? Good. How was your weekend? It's Wednesday evening and you know what that means. It's Live Laugh Love Wednesdays with Ashton. Mm -hmm. Love the new weirdest games ever episode. Hope you are having a great day. I am. I am. I'm having a good day. I'm, I'm, a, uh, uh, I'm a bit all over the place today. Brain, this week's been a bit of a weird one. Brain's a bit, uh, uh, you know what I mean? Brain's a bit like, frazzled is the best word for it. And also I'm a bit upset, right? And I'll tell you why. Duke my Goliath, thank you for the gifted sub. He's 612 on the channel, that's crazy. Duke might check and congratulations on getting a sub. Uh, I, I put my hair in buns last night and it came out this morning and it was really, really nice and curled. Yeah. It looked really nice. Hello Ashton, great to see you back. We missed you last Wednesday when you didn't do a stream. Yeah, there was no stream for me last week, sorry about that. Um, and, and now it's gone all crap. Now it looks just like I haven't brushed it, which is also true. Because it was curly, so I didn't brush it. Now it just looks like I haven't brushed it. Drat! Anyway, how's everyone doing? Has everyone recovered from last week? Is everyone feeling better from last week's stream? Have we moved on? Have we all blocked out of, my, of your memory? I actually kind of have, you know. Um, didn't really think about that much um, after the fact. And, and to be honest, I can't really remember what happened in that book. Well, I can, but I think I've blocked out my memory, so I'm, I don't need to be reminded by either you or my own self. So, um, so yeah, what a, what a stream that was. So much so that people thought I got fired for it. I did not get fired for it. You'll, I'm sure you'll all be pleased to know I did not get fired for it. Um, get in! Another cheeky one. Slip through the net, baby. <laughs> um, Cosmic Rose, thank you for the 30 bits. It's Chaos Wednesday with Ashton. Not sure what could top last stream, but I'm excited to find out. This absolutely will not top uh, last week's stream, but it might be fun anyway. Um, Stephen, thank you for gifting us up to Boring Lona. C congrats, everyone. Um, yeah, I wish my hair was. Yeah. Just looks crap now. It's fine. I'm just a bit sad about it. We're just going to move on. Yeah. Today. Ashton was let go and replaced with Ishton. Look, if, I w if Ishton was here, she has much better hair than me. So, sorry about it. Still me, still little old Ashton. I'm not going anywhere. Even if they sack me, probably got like a, a two week period before I get let go. I don't know how it works. I've never been fired before. Cause I'm a good uh, worker. Good, good, strong, positive worker. That's me. Um, so, yeah, it's just a little old me. Isha's not here yet. Like I said, if she was, she'd have better hair. I'm taking my shoes off because it's upsetting me. I've got sock sockies on that say Prosec Ho Ho Ho. Um, because it's Christmas socks because <laughs> they were on top of the drawer. Uh, anyway, today we're playing a game that I once played a while ago, but then we ended up doing a, oh my God, all of the, the art is falling off the wall. Oh my god, I'll fix that afterwards. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm playing Animal Play a little while ago, but then we got a uh, sponsored stream, so I didn't get to play it. 
Um, so we're playing it now instead. It's called Tiny Kin. I haven't played any of it and I'm excited to play it. It's a platformer, got with little dudes, and I'm excited. Um, Dandy, thank you so much for subscribing for 39 months. Hi Ash, and happy subversary on Wednesday stream to you. Hope you're doing good. Currently beaming from a handwritten thank you card from a lovely Samuel de Barber for some art he received from me. I've never had that before. I got the feels. Oh, that's so nice. That's so nice, so cute. Love that. I love this community. You guys are so nice to each other. Cute. Cute! Uh, so cute. Anyway, so yeah, I'm gonna play this game. I'm excited to play it. Um, once again, I'm gonna be bad at it. So we're just gonna go with the flow, you know? I also, we might have to, I might have to reboot the game because I might have accidentally um, skipped the beginning. Whoa, let's head over there. Uh, oh! Hold on, I forgot to actually yeah. tell it to. I like your hair. Mine is also unruly. Lean into it, I say. Thank you. Um, thank you, Pop George, for your 100 bits. Hello, 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 game. Hello, game. Cool. I just have to wait five to ten business days for it to uh, turn on. Let me just turn the music down a bit. It's lovely, but, you know, shut up. So, yeah, this is Tiny Kid. We're going to play it. Uh, yeah. That's okay. We didn't really make any progress. Aegis, my beautiful planet, shining with life. The home planet of humanity, according to what they teach in school. Nowadays, I'm the one teaching. I'm Maladin, an archaeologist and researcher in the most prestigious university in the world. Cute. And this is Nevis, my assistant. I like Nevis. <laughs> He's my favorite. I've studied relics, artifacts, and fossils. And my conclusion is clear. Humans do not originate from Aegis, but somewhere else. Our true home what? planet awaits us far beyond the stars. During my research, I came across an ancient signal, clearly of human origin, emanating from a nearby galaxy. Since that discovery, I've been preparing to go and meet the originator of the signal. This guy kind of sounds like uh, from pole to pole. And now we found it. The, uh, it's decided. Never and I will go to this mysterious Willow planet to uncover the secret it's so of humanity's cool. origins. And he wears a fedora. It's kind of the vibe I'm getting from this guy whose name I've already forgot. Milo? Oh, fire sounds okay. Equipment damaged. Origin unknown. Age? Undetermined. Antenna absent. Mandibles atrophied. Oh no. <laughs> hey Eden and Pops, thank you so much for subscribing for 24 months. Happy two year anniversary. Stream this recently, such a good, cute game. We hope you are well, Ash and everybody. I'm not bad, I hope you are also well. Yes! I love this! Love this! This vibe is good. Good vibe. Good vibe. Do you hear me? You hear me, everyone? Say it together. Good vibe. Where's my, where's my bloody mouse? I can't find it. Anyway, came out of nowhere. I was worried you might wake up. I never wake up. You seem to be okay. Sorry, I never met anyone of your species. Do you need orientation? Yeah. Set up something to help you find your way and get used to your equipment. Do you feel free to have? Do you feel free to have a look? Okay. Good vibes. Thank you. All right, leave me some time to get your bearings. Hashtag good vibes only. Thank you, Stephen. Exactly. Thank you for your 100 bits. Good vibes only. Good vibes only today. Oh my god, I love this. Look how cute it is. Yeah, yeah, I'm into this. <coughs> yes. Oh, bubble glider. Announcement. Good vibes. I didn't know you could do that. Oh, damn it. I fell off. I was distracted by announcement. Good vibes. I may have chilled out loud when I saw you and thought you were playing this on the stream today. I've played it through multiple times since it came out. Oh, I haven't really heard anyone yeah. talk about it that much. I'm so glad people... Haunted today? No burns. <laughs> Black Shield Legion. Thank you for the 100 bits. Nothing is haunted yet, no. Yet, I say, because who knows? There might be a ghost. Yeah, little mate. Little mates! Little friends! Yay! And we played 
Ratchet and Clank, the 2016 version, you know that bit when um, Clank's got like his, it might not be the 2016 version, but you know, if you played it, you know what I mean, where like he's got his little robot mates and they're kind of following you along. I got really upset when I had to leave them behind. I actually had a cry. I was hormonal, but still, I was like, I don't want to leave them. And that's how I feel about these little dudes. If I have to leave them behind, I'm gonna be really upset. Wait, Tinykins are following you? How? They normally wander around the house and ignore everyone, but they seem to like you. Tinykin have fascinating capabilities and may finally find someone who can use them. For example, Pink Tinykin are the strongest. They can push or carry objects. Together they can carry even the heaviest of objects. That'll come in handy. Follow me. Okay. Sag. Sag. I see that flower pot. You throw your pink tiny can I? They can probably move it and I'll block the passage. My research has shown me that an object of great importance was locked under the great staircase. There's no way in. Don't worry. Oh, yay! <laughs> I love them so much. Oh no, I missed. The issue I have is that I have absolutely terrible depth perception. And... Ah, more mates. Yay! <laughs> Look at you all! I shall name you all Terence. Terences. Come on, Terences. Have to go find more of your kind. Hello, Terence. Hello, Terence. Welcome to the club, Terence. Nice to meet you, Terence. Hello, Terence. Let's go. Let's go, Terences. Can we go up here? We can. Bless up. Terence. Nice to meet you, Terence. This is Terence. And Terence and Terence and Terence and Terence. Ah, oh, Terence. <laughs> so glad you're here. Meet Terences. Oh, Terence. Lovely to see you again. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> yes, double Terence. Another double Terence. Come on, Terences. Is the plural of Terence Terence? Hmm. What do you call a collection of Terences? Okay. A Terry of Terences. Let's go, Terences! Terence. Terence, yeah. A colony of Terrants. A torrent of Terrences. A terrarium of Terraces. A Terrace? Oh, all such good suggestions. Let us go, Terrences. Yeah, it's called Tinykins. I don't know if it's on. I should have probably might be on PlayStation. It's on Game Pass if you've got Game Pass. A truancy of Terence's. That's a good one. I don't know. Maybe have a good have a Google. If anyone knows, feel free to put it in chat. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> Look at the noise they make. Oh yeah, no, this is doing it for me. This is making me, it is on PS4 and PS5. Oh, fantastic news. Oh. It's really doing it for me, I'm not gonna lie. Come on, guys! <laughs> Mr. Hops on your personal top 10 list of 2022. Oh, I kind of, I was meant to play it last year, but it never got round to it, and I'm so sad. I feel this would have absolutely been up there. I'm, not, I'm enjoying it so much already. Mila Dame, right? Come on, I'll explain everything. Can I keep. Yay! Terrence is! Did Ashen just say, look at the noise they make, lol? Sounds like something I would say. Certainly feels less traumatizing. I'm trying to make up for it. I'm trying to make up for how much I traumatized everyone last week by playing this game. Yay! 
Welcome to my humble abode, Melodane. Or Milodane. You see that schematic on the wall? I do. Yes, good schematic. Once upon a time, a being known as Arduin lived in his house, wise and good. Many consider him as a deity. I think he was more of a sage. I believe the schematic was drawn up by Arduin himself in order to assemble a machine that could go beyond the house. Yay! I've spent my whole life trying to find the components, and thanks to you, we've managed to collect one already. Ah, oh, you guys are cute. Managed to locate the five others, however, getting them won't be that easy. Your transportation device is damaged, and you need to go home, don't you? In that case, you have no other choice than to help me. Ha ha! Oh, and I have some friends to introduce you to. Prattle! Ah, Prattle's so cute! Everyone never any pit of knowledge. Sikaru, a nectar brewer who travels mountains and valleys. He's got a little hat on and talks to them at some point. I, I, I'm going now. That's because you'll get tired walking around. I wasn't able to save your soap board, but I found a replacement. Take it. It's a bar of soap. Soap board. Oh. You can just slide wherever you want and get around a lot faster. Takes a little practice, but I'm sure you'll love it. Hold RB to slide around your sofa. Try it out. <laughs> yes, I will. I almost forgot. Oh, I see that. Yeah. She's not very talkative, but very diligent. Use your soap balls to slide along with silk strings and join me. Oh, awesome, man. Uh, ma man, looking for some wholesome games is so hard to find now, it's true. I'm trying to get my young kids six or four to play on the PlayStation, so if I don't have country and poor child I've been their go-to, it's a blast watching them get into it. That's so cute. <laughs> That's so cute. Have you tried Stray? It might be a little bit intense, but... I think it's a pretty good game to play with the kids, maybe. Come with me, I know where we should start looking. Can I speak to Prattle first? Banner, located in the city of Sanctar. This way, Milladane. Go through here as soon as you're ready. Also, have you tried um, Disney Dreamlight Valley? I'm a Disney Dreamlight Valley stan. Um... Thief, in the collection, bring it back. What did you do with my artifacts, villain? Wait, it wasn't you, was it? They've watched me play, but they got bored, lol. I should try again. Oh, that's sad. Hmm. Welcome to the Arbor Museum. I'm the curator, Mr. Prattle. Unfortunately, our establishment suffered an odious and villainous attack. No. Most of our collection was vanished. The dinosaur guards are looking into it, but you know how it is. I need all the help I can get. Bring me back the artifacts in good condition. I will offer to you the greatest of rewards, my knowledge. Okay. Anything for you, babe? Oh. So you're Milo. Welcome to the most distinguished brewery in the whole house. It's not the only brewery in the whole house. Since everyone started gorging themselves on that nasty, cheap doom is, that distinct nectar has been lost and people are content with whatever junk they can get their hands on. Your eyes give with interest. You wish to help. In each room, I'll be able to collect the pollen you find. I need to make the most resplendent vintages. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to get pollen and artifacts. Artifact. <laughs> yeah, cute noise. Try this again. They're way into Disneyland. I think they'll really like it. It's a bit like Animal Crossing. It's one of those games you're going to have to come back to, but I think kids were just like walking around and having fun and just playing. Maybe the eight-year-old might be able to do some of the like quests and stuff, but it's, a, it's only single player though. But I suppose you know, kids will argue anyway, won't they? I assume. Here is the entrance to Sanctar, a place of sacred pilgrimage dedicated to Great Arden. The banner belongs to a pious shield bug named Solaria. This object is very important to her, and she won't give it back easily. I was spare key for Sanctar. Obtained through totally legitimate means here. Sus. Counting on you, and I can't wait to see all the things you'll do with the tiny kin. I'm gonna do so much with the tiny kin. They're gonna be, gonna be going crazy. My little mates. Oh. 
Come on, Terence. Terence, you're gonna be right getting up here. Yeah, Terence is not really bothered. It's like, yeah, whatever. Bloody Terence. Tiny King won't follow you from one room to another, but they're not very brave. No, no. I want them to come with me. All the Terences have to stay here. I'll be back, Terences. I'll miss you with all of my heart. Almost to Sanctar. Be good for mummy. Love you, Terences. All 30 of you. Bye, Terences. Love you. A religious heart, adepts and pilgrims assemble in the cathedral to honour Arduin, the creator, and sing a sacred... We're back in Sanctar. Congratulations, companions. The exhibition has borne fruit. What a haul. So many unknown objects and this strange relic. By Arduin. He was that is, is what we need to complete our quest. Hard to say, but I appreciate your enthusiasm. It is indeed about time we solve the mystery of the canticle echoing through our minds. Generation upon generation of shield bugs and Arduin himself is counting on us. Welcome to the Sanctar, a land of consecrated by the melody of Arduin's canticle. Only a shield bug can hear his voice. Strange, isn't it? The mystery resists all attempts to solve it. Any help you can offer will be appreciated. Speaking of mysteries, our missionaries have discovered something. A large round relic. Go take a look. If you miss it, you must be blind. Ha ha! Okay, bye! Knowing to get the banner will not be easy task. It seems that the Sanctine Shieldbug was to broadcast Arden's canticle to make it accessible to everyone, but how? Something tells me this large circle is the key. I wonder why the little Shieldbug nearby is so excited. Let's find out! Hmm. This man's name is Pony. <laughs> Not Tony, it can't be Tony. I think I just like the name Tony. This guy's name. These are the Claire's. These are the Claire's. Oh no, the Claire's. Oh no, the Claire's. Terences. Oh no, the Claire's. Ten, I only have four. can't jump in the water, okay. The water is not good. The water is bad vibes. Frog. Spent a long time building this temple. What would Arduin, would Arduin have appreciated it? I'm gonna blow that thing up in a minute. I just... I'm just, I've only got these Claire's and I'm, I'm attached to them. The Claire's give themselves willingly to a greater good. The Claire's should have free will. The Claire's. Terrence's get to live. The 
Let's just have the die. RIP Claire's. Miss you Claire's. How many Claire's do I have? I have eight Claire's. Claire's don't go gently into that good night. Rage, rage against the dying of light or something. No, I think that's a pretty accurate description of Claire's. The Claire's are so full of rage. This is my imager. Press that button, you stand in front of the big eye and prove it creates an image of what it sees. It's a bit heavy, but my followers help me move it around. I have at least one image of me in every room. Okay, well, I'll leave it there for now. What's the problem? Is there at the bottom of the big closet? A monster, gigantic, covered with hair. Wicked eyes, deadly fang, looks to tear me into pieces. Okay. Jeremiah Tapar, thank you for subscribing for 36 months. Cow, keys, keys. <laughs> How are you able to stand there talking about it? It's your monster, is that, if your monster's not terrible. Managed to escape through a gap and block the entrance. Think I'm going to buy that? Hmm, you need someone neutral. You with the weird hair. Did you bring us some evidence of fangs, some hair, or a drawing? Proof that would show that there's really something in there, otherwise Dubby won't have a sharp about it. Oh, you want me to take a picture of it? Okay, well, we'll do that later. Well, I guess we could do it now. Claire's! Oh, I don't have enough. Come back, Terrence's. We need to find some more of you. More Claire's, the dream. Oh, it's the post office. They're just like us. Oh, I want this stuff actually. Pleasant egglets for a single loaf of bread. Surprise these days, hardly any goods are coming in from Ambrose. Good bread, the food they've got now got so some barely edible. Now on top of this overpriced, I'm going to trade it somewhere else. It's Claire time, baby. I have four Claire's left. Hello. Got any Claire's in here? No. No bloody Claire's in here, I'm not interested. I'm only looking for Claire's. Ow. There's some Claire's up there. Mad Claire's. Uh, uh. So what I did at the weekend, I went out to a place in Newcastle called Soju and Goji, and I had Korean food, and it absolutely slapped Richard. Slapped Richard, I tell you. Uh, we weren't allowed to do Korean barbecue because our chimney was broken. But we did do um, we did do uh, some other Korean food, and I got tteokbokki, and honestly, it's changed my life. I've wanted to try it for ages because I like watching um, Korean uh, YouTube, and currently really started enjoying K a K drama called The uh, Extraordinary Attorney Wu. I'm obsessed with it. And uh, I wanted to try for ages. And then they had it and I was like, I'm getting this. And I was so excited when it came out. I did a little dance. 
So if you're ever in Newcastle, I highly suggest Soju and Goji, they're really good. Hello. Splendid's delightful time, the fragile told me to give misadventure one of her most precious gems of falling into this image box. It's like an agile fellow. Would you mind getting in there and turning the machine back on so I'm going to get the gem out? Oh, oh the hell are they out there? A good two bubbles of flight. Oh, I don't have that. Actually, before we do this, maybe we should do the story mission. Oh no, we've only got one Claire left! Just the one Claire actually. Oh no! We freed some Terrences with some Claire's! Is this where the monster is? I haven't got any Claire's left. Oh, I want some more Claire's. A lot less mild peril than, than in pick rounds so far. I picked this so far, so good. I'm glad. I'm glad for this fact. Oh yeah, three Twitch babies. Oh my gosh, congratulations on your, on your third trip, babe. Twitch baby. Gosh. I could speak, that'd be good, wouldn't it? Oh no, I've used all my Claire's up. Some more Claire's down here. Is this the monster? So cute. Right, so when we've got enough voice to carry that thing, we'll come back. I think we'll have to talk to this guy. Why don't adults ever listen to me? No more problems with uh, people faking my Instagram, thank God. The relic must be carried to the cupboard up there. The relic and the poster have the same picture. I'll do it myself, but I'm too small. You can use the pink tinykin, right? Throw a few in the relic and they take care of it. Okay, I'm not gonna get told off for stealing, am I? Oh. Gang, I'm afraid. How can I tell him to stop doing that? I need a bunch of Claire's. I need loads of Claire's. I'm looking for, I'll take 10 of your finest Claire's, please. Melody, she's playing the piano. Her mother is still there. Do you know anything? No, I don't know. I'll come back to talk. She's got she's collecting mad Claire. Oh, got to get loads of Claire's. Crazy amount of Claire's. You hear me? Ooh. 
How many clairs we need? I think it was ten. Ten clairs. How many clairs do you need? We need ten clairs. We still have ten clairs. Brilliant news. In fact, we have fifteen clairs. Five more clairs than we need. Practically rolled it in clairs. Oh my god, look at this place. More clairs! Yes! surplus of clairs. We do not have a million clairs to our name. I wish we did. Miss, miss having so many clairs. Right. Yay. Encouraged. Thanks so much. Hope you're having a good day too. Yay! Claire's! You can't hide from me, Claire's! I'm the Claire Hunter! Cooey Cooey! Who did that? Do it again. Cooey Cooey! Yay! Cooey Cooey! Do it again. Where'd that come from? Gooey gooey! Are you the mum? Have you seen my daughter Melody? Came to pick her up because she didn't show up for dinner and she usually ran here keeping this old piano in tune. But she should have been home by now. I'm really starting to get nervous. I have to stay here in case she shows up. Is it possible someone knows something about her disappearance? There is a restaurant not far away and the Felix... Oh yeah, I've been there. Is that a cat tower? Cute. Maybe I saw something there. I'll go check for you in a minute. I just need to get all this stuff. I'm looking for Claire's. I have enough Claire's now, but you, know, you can never have too many Claire's. No such thing as too many Claire's. Too many Claire's, too many Claire's. Kiwi Kiwi! Yay! Hello. Dooby 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 doo. No, it's doo doo shooby doo doo doo. Shooby dooby doo. That's not it. Yeah, okay. Oh no! I have one less one less Claire than I need. I got cocky with my Claire's.
be honest guys, this is really doing it for me. I feel immensely satisfied. I'm gonna take this with me just in case. You never know what you might need one of these. Yay, more clairs. Munch, 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 munch. I don't think he does blink, but who needs to blink when you've got this many little mates to look at all the time? So busy just staring at your, your little mates. God, I'm so much stuff. Nectar, that's what it's called. I forgot. Oh, so many clairs. I've got 25 flipping clairs. Forgotten media, thanks so much for subscribing. 15 months. Oh, that's where I have to go to get the thingy, but I don't have enough. Yay! <laughs> Whoopsie, I fell down. Happy hump day to you as well, for God Media. Hope you're having a good day. Everyone's having a good day. My day was a bit sad, and then I started playing this game. Now I have no care in the world. Not one care. No, well, no cares, just good vibes. And loads of clairs. No cares, just clairs. Oh. Interesting. Okay. Okay, well, I did kind of want to go to the bottom, so I made it, made it to where it needs to be. Yes! Go, Claire's. You guys have been so helpful, just, just taking them in and I'm just ignoring them. Secret bar. Oh, damage from that. There's a fire down here. Right. Go see our mates who we've just abandoned. Where are they gone? I assume in here somewhere. Probably up there, right? guys gonna go over there oh okay <laughs> taking that somewhere they weren't taking that They come and pray to the great Ardwin, but he never answers. Maybe he's just shy. Maybe he's just shy. So true, guys. It's quite anxiety. The gang is just carrying. have to look to where that goes. They just took that wherever I wanted it. Thank you, little friends. Some more clairs. Never know when you've got enough clairs. The answer is you've never got enough clairs. You hear me? Never. 
around all this stuff, I have no idea what I'm gonna do with it all. There's stuff in it. It's got a bunch of stuff. Bam. And on this day, I said, let there be light. See you later, Mr. Black. Have a good evening. to get up there somehow. Is there another way I can get across over there? Maybe up that way? What do you think, gang? Is that the way to go? Doesn't appear to be a way up this way. Oh. I'm actively having to go back on myself because I just want more flares. Resist the, the wiles of a Claire. Cannot resist. I'm very much enjoying it. I like the way it looks, I like the way it sounds. I'm enjoying this game. This game, yes, it's doing it for me. the cable there yeah I think it's been cut you need something to replace it without that we need to be able to pop the cryptic machine get a conductor near the giant armpit but she hasn't come back okay how do I make that this thing go down though I want all my Terrences back but they're stuck working for the man every night and day can I stand on that? No, I cannot. Oh, that's so far away! Damn it. Go deliver this letter. We're such good people. And apparently we work for the postal service. More Claire's, baby! Way! <laughs> oh, is this how you get up here? Oh my god, this is how you get up here and be all the way around there after all. Ugh. I'm not really talking much, am I? I'm just really enjoying playing this game. Sorry about that. <laughs> Sorry, everyone. Uh, I'm just having a good time. Having a grand old time, to be honest.
Kablam! Get that CD into place, homies. Right, left, right, left, right. Yay! I'm just live, laugh, loving. Live, love, laughing. Exactly. I'm live, love, laughing. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm, I know I'm not supposed to enjoy myself when we're streaming. I know that. I'm sorry. Oh, God. I hate that I'm enjoying myself. Somebody make it stop. I'm sick to my stomach. I'm enjoying myself. for a child sorry no offense but i'm known in this fine establishment rumors spread fast here at the felix the clientele is mostly tourist travelers and i'm always happy to tell stories anyway i've never seen anyone who looks quite like you okay i'm looking for someone who knows anything about someone stuck in the piano Well, I'm glad taking this then. Where are you guys going with that? Oh, back to the piano. Yay. What's the first CD I ever bought or had bought for me? I think the first CD I ever had was just a single, actually, and it was the uh, Band Aid single from like when I was like eight. Uh, my grandparents got it for me for Christmas and I spent all Christmas evening while they were round or it might have been Boxing Day, either way sat in the um, in the kitchen listening to it on the CD player so I was really excited oh I definitely had a pop party as well but that's the first one I remember being like really excited to get we had so many pop parties yeah, it might have been Band Aid 20. That would make the most sense. Probably in like 2005 or something. I was quite young. Wrong. That may not have been the first one I actually owned though, it's the first one I remember being so excited for. I was like, I was buzzing when I unwrapped that. Had cassette tapes, hey that's okay. Some of us were born earlier than others and that's, that's totally fine. Oh, I forgot they were carrying around that letter. Oh, we'll put it somewhere in a minute. We've got to collect some more Claire's because we're running low on Claire's. We're starting to run low on the old Claire's. So old, my first CD was Iron Maiden's Seventh Son and Seventh Son. First music I bought was Elton John's I'm Still Standing. That's pretty cool. My seven inch single. <laughs> Kids Bop. Oh my god. We didn't really have any of that in, in England, Kids Bop. We had like, we had like S Club Junior, but they just sung like six songs for kids, I think. As in like, I think they wrote their own songs. I don't remember them performing like other people's songs. Though I don't remember, I, I was a child. We definitely don't have anything currently like Kids Bop. Well, actually I don't know. I'm not currently a child, so maybe we do have telling me about it. Hello. I'm used to dealing with this old piano. It normally goes out of tune over time, but this happened overnight. 
was this weird golden coin it was tangled in the string that I tried to pull it out but it got stuck thanks for helping me out there a gold coin I'll leave you the golden coin I might figure out what to do with it thank you I remember trying to find that band aid 20 online sometimes because I saw the bus did was on it a bit more difficult to get in the states at the time ah yeah that's fair how big was S Club 7 when you were young? Uh, they were huge. Absolutely huge. Um, when I was in uni, two of S Club 7, even though they marked themselves S Club 7, but there was in fact only two of them, came to my uni and performed. Obviously, I was uh, gassed out my bloody brain, but um, they were absolutely huge when I was younger. And when they performed, we were right at the front. She touched my hand, I can't remember which one it was. It wasn't Rachel. Excuse me, sorry. Um, and man, I love them. And this girl in the front row was absolutely sobbing. I was in my first year of uni and this girl was in the front of a club in Leicester called Republic, which is a horrible club. Do not go there if you're in Leicester. That's just, every time I went there I got sexually harassed thanks Stephen. um one time some guy just like fully grabbed my throat and i was like no do you know what i'm out thanks so and i've never been back since um but <laughs> but they were there and this girl was like sobbing crying and i was like gal i'm pretty white girl wasted but i'm not crying over bloody lisa from one direction not one direction s club seven God, that's what happened a lot today. I've been s my brain's not working. John, Bradley, John, Paul, Rachel, Tina, Hannah, and Joe. I can't remember which who it was. It was. There was one black guy, wasn't it? The one black guy, and I'm, I think it might have been Joe. It might have been Tina. Hold on, I'm, I'm gonna look it up. I'm gonna look up S Club 7 members. S, S Club 7. But I need to know what they look like now, because Okay, it was, it was Joe and Bradley. Joe and Bradley, they were the ones that performed. So it's just two of them. Just two of them. If there's no Rachel or Hannah, then I'm not interested, I had a crush on those two. I had a crush on Rachel too, but the thing is, I didn't know who was, I thought, you know, S Club 7 is S Club 7. I didn't realize S Club 7 was actually just Joe and Bradley. But it was, it was just, in fact, it was just Joe and just Bradley. Which, hey, they're getting their bag, good for them, but. <laughs> so just SC or B7, like the vitamin. <laughs> Do you know what I was, oh my God, who, what band is this? It's Steps. When I was home over Christmas, um, they had this thing on, my mum was like at a Christmas party when me and Ben got to my parents' house. And so it was me and my dad and Ben, and we were all just sitting and like having a drink and chatting and whatever. And uh, we put this Christmas music channel on and it was like a Christmas quiz that was like happening whilst like in between music and stuff. And it'll be very much like, um, you know, what song was num the Christmas number one, who beat out like Alicia Dixon or whatever, you know, not Alicia Dixon, what's her name? One of the women from, um, I think I'm thinking of Leona Lewis, but no, I'm thinking of Alexander Burke um, for Christmas number one or whatever. And I was playing and I was getting so many answers right, but Steps, a Steps Christmas song came on, which was not really anything about Christmas at all. The only um, bit about Christmas really was like the fact that they were in a winter area. And one of them, women, 
had like dreadlocks, like blonde dreadlocks. She looked awful, awful I tell you. Dreadlocks are already bad on white people anyway, but she looked terrible. I know it was like the early thousands, but my God, bad, bad hair. I'd be fuming. Yeah, I think it was Faye, I think you're right. I would be fuming if someone, if I was famous, and someone put me in that, mm, no, sacked. Maybe she liked it, maybe it's what she wanted, but if she was my friend, I'd be like, um, no, we're not doing that. You're gonna look bad. Sorry about it, you just are. And then if she got upset, I'd be like, look, I don't make the rules. I just stopped you from making a fool of yourself. Well, I'm not, fa I don't, I do not believe I am famous. So I'm not gonna say, I say if I was famous because I mean, if I was famous. Cause I can go out to pizza and like, you know, I can go for dinner and no one cares. No one's gonna be following me around and be like, can I take a picture of you? If you're famous, it's silly costumes every day forever. I, if I was famous, I'd be, I'd go fill out on John. And you'd never know what I was gonna walk out in next. You'd be like, what is she wearing? Why is she wearing a bucket hat and a reverse dungaree? Figure that out, what does that mean? I don't know what reverse dungaree is, but let's figure out what reverse dungaree is together as a group. Um, and I would just, you know, I'd be, I'd, I'd just always just doing some stuff. You know, some celebrities are always just like doing something and you're like, why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? That's like what I'd, what I'd do. If you're famous that someone's making fake Instagram accounts for you, but I think that happens to regular, like people who are not on the internet as well. Like I'm pretty sure that's happened to my friend before and she's just a regular person. Or at least, I mean, not always like free photos. Come and see my mum and that, but the worst thing would be arms covered in a bib. Yeah, it would be like uh, this. Your torso is like fully covered in denim, and at the bottom you've just got like just like a flap on either side, like kind of rocking the Tarzan. You know, and you can like you can like if you want to attach it to your legs for more safety for the flap flapping around in the wind, but. Cowards do that. Now, what's that thing? <laughs> True. Ain't no party like an S Club party because an S Club party had several OSHA violations and the events are not allowed to continue until those are corrected. Pretty much. Pretty much. Right, what was I doing over here? What am I doing? I need to find a cable. She said it was by the, maybe it's at the bottom. Oh, you're welcome. Oh, it's nose. I know that people not on the internet don't have Instagram accounts. I mean, I meant like, you know, not an internet person. You know what I mean? Very pedantic lot. <laughs> yeah, we should, we should make reverse dungarees, you're right. We should. Should be our thing. I don't know if it would do well, but I'm give it a bloody good go. No triple drop merch yet. Reverse dungies. I love the little noise they make when they're carrying things. It's so cute. Go. 
I wish I made those cute. I wish I made those cute noises when I was carrying things. I know. Mine's like, Ugh. and then sometimes I get like, well, when I'm carrying things that are too heavy, I'm carrying like shopping bags. I scrunch my nose up, and then it makes my nose go funny and tingly, and I don't like it. Let's go, vibes. Vibes are good. How is this possible? I've been camping that resounds through the sancta. Even the ants can hear it. Now the voice of the creator can be heard. Studied by all. Did Arvids himself send it to you as a reward for your efforts? You're getting really cold. I'm going to have to turn it up. I'm freezing. 26 seems sensible. I was on 29 earlier. I appeared to try to put the sun in here. And like how you have to wear a shirt or something under the dungarees, you have to wear pants or something. Yeah, I think we should just make these. I think we, you know, we should absolutely make these. Carry it proudly. Okay. How many boys have I got? 31. That means we can go and do this thing over here. Remember the camera thing that was there a ago? We got distracted about because I started doing other things. Reverse overalls can be made in denim and corduroy, you know, we're not going to gatekeep. Dungarees come in both. 29, are you cooking a meal in this room? Exactly. Put some shorts on and start tanning, it was so hot. Yay. The music's not, is the music too loud? I don't know if the music is too loud, because the music has suddenly, I feel, got very loud, because the vibe's in this in this bedroom type situation. Hey, Hitch away. they can be whatever you want. You are the designer of your own reverse dungarees. Clairs, so many bloody Clairs right now. So many Clairs, so many Terences. Look, 31 bloody Terences. We're popping off. I think we we all want reverse dungarees. We all want them. We're just ahead of our time, you know. People don't understand the hype yet. They don't get it don't understand that reverse dungarees are the next big thing you can have yeah I think you can have straps around your legs you know I think you, you don't have to use you can have like one strap you know how sometimes you have just like the one side up on a dungy and if you want to be a bit saucy you know how sometimes people wear dungarees and don't wear top on they just wear like a bra or something but like, oh I've just got my du reverse dungies on and no underwear, or no trousers on underneath. So saucy. Reverse dungarees. Coming to a store near you. Probably. How do I get up there? Absolutely, it's kind to exclamation mark shock when I convinced the boys to make reverse dungarees after I explained to them in great detail what a reverse dungaree is and they say Ashton please can you stop talking we're trying to work and I will say this is important this is important I'm doing the Lord's work and the Lord said the Lord came to me in a vision and he said make reverse dungarees I can't, ignore, I can't ignore that. I can't ignore the word of the Lord. I'm so hungry all of a sudden. Why am I talking about reverse dungarees that made me hungry? Explain that, atheists.
You're so right, Boring Luna. Ben is a killjoy. <laughs> You're so right. some mock-ups, I've got nothing better to do. Ben was so reversed, Dungaree's mint, mint tints first. Oh my god, so sassy. Subscribing at tier one for 27 months. Did you see that Power Washing Mate is getting a free Tomb Raider themed update? I did not. Oh, it's exciting. I haven't played that in a while. It's a good game. I like that game. Yeah, yeah, coin. Broken on. Right, so there's a thing over there. What is that? Like a jar of mayonnaise or something. That's a sick trick. Yay! Do we get to wash too? I hope so. You'd think so, wouldn't you? There'd be some tomb washing involved. We raid them and then we wash them. So they're nice and clean for the next person to to destroy and ruin them, the sanctity of. Hey. Croft Manor, the whole thing is filthy and filled with dead butlers. Nightmare! Who left all these dead butlers in here? God damn it, I got there fine last time. What's happening? Damn it! I'm gonna go up here now. All the butlers are in the freezer. clapping for me. Okay, well we don't need the banner right now. We're still exploring this area. Oh, Nectar Man. Serve a favour sludge. Brood with whatever they find. So hear me out. The pollen around here it sings. I need to brew to the beat. Listen to harmonise the mix as long as you bring me pollen balls from across the sanctuary. Um, managed to collect all the pollen. I need it from the sanctuary. Here it is. Read me, told me you might find it useful for this substance. Oh, do I get a double bubble? Double bubble! Double bubble! Get in. We love a double bubble.
I'm really close to getting a triple bubble. Yeah, have a double bubble? Then we'll have a triple bubble. Mm, bloody bubble central around here. Around these parts. Two thirds of a triple bubble, exactly. Right. How do I get up there then? Oh, I don't need to. Noise! Right, we're going over there. Unscrew that thing! Team Triple Bubble. Team Double Bubble Jump. These are all good suggestions for a rebrand if we ever need to do one. Okay, my picture box. The attorney spent in here, the nasty thief comes in, cuts the cable, and everything stops. No more sparks, no more nothing. Yeah. I'll find your thing. Happy 420 BBBB Blazing Monkey. Already? Since we are making many little new friends today, here are some tiny jokes. What do you call a tiny mother? A mini mom. Ha ha ha. What is tiny and gets washed ashore? A microwave. Ha <laughs> ha. It is small. Furry and blue. It's all pipes. A mouse get here. Ho ho ho. What do you call a towel that loves to tell small lies? Microfibber? Very good. Oh, ooh, ooh. Why couldn't the pony sing in the choir? Because it was a little horse. Hi, who? That's a good Moggy one. Moggy Tiny Peter Tiny Bab. Yeah. Thank you. B B B B B B B B Tiny B B B B B B B Reverse B B B B B B B Dungarees B B B B B B New Merch Idea B B B B Blaze It. Stephen and Lord Brotherson, thank you so much for the 100 bits to celebrate 420. Um. All of those jokes are fantastic and um, absolutely will be working on reverse dungarees going forward. Uh, at least I will, my own personal time. One day you're going to look on my Instagram and you're going to be like, oh my god, wait, are these? Oh, those are reverse dungarees. She did it, she made them. And I will be like, yes, I did. I'm going to put pinnacle of fashion. Here's my reverse dungarees. You're welcome. You're welcome, fashion industry. Finally, someone's done it, and it was me. That's true. I might. So my Instagram imposter might uh, actually steal it first. But collector's item. Just need to um, put the left, the last, find the last letter. I'm also missing like seven little dudes. They can go around your thighs. That's where you'd like the straps to go. Or you can put them around your crotch or underneath. You know, there's options. Whatever floats your boat. How many bugs need to fill in an apartment? I don't know. Tenants! Tenants, get it? Bloody Karen. I thought it was a good joke, babe. God, there's so many, so many guys. Sniper, got an achievement called Sniper. Have I got like all of the things now? Just a few more pollens. I think I've got everything. Ooh woo, ooh woo. Hear ye, hear ye. Ooh woo, ooh woo, ooh woo, ooh woo, ooh woo. Ooh woo. 
Sorry. Don't know why I'm doing that. Just gonna go with it, I think. I think I am alright. I don't know. That was weird. I'm just gonna ignore that. I was watching an episode of Charm the other day where Alyssa Milano was wearing a crop top made out of the front crotchal part of a pair of jeans, complete with butterfly. Oh my god, icon. The precursor to the reverse thungies. Okay. Give me your bloody things. Finishing this area 100%. Damn it, I need 40 more pollens. Everywhere. Yeah, go in there. How to make that looking good on anyone doesn't look like Alyssa Milano. Oh, forgot a media. Will you tweet me a picture? I kind of want to see it. If you can find a picture of it. I need to get 38 more pollens. I don't think I've missed anyone here. Yeah. Have all my pollens! I don't need to get woolen, I guess. There's some up there. So much. So much pollen. I must have missed like one big vein of it somewhere. There it is. Hey Kenhausen, how are you doing? Wednesday. Mm, still twenty five off. I'm into this game. I don't know if you can tell, I'm really into this game. But a bit sad boy at the moment because it's like I'm not really I'm not really vibing with a lot of games at the moment. Like I can't find something that's really tickling my pickle, do you know what I mean? So this is making me feel good because it's tickling my pickle in a good way. No, I fall. Play. Give me that trap. I'm also hungry. Just get some food. Go get some food going out the trap. Go get some go get some food. I want to see more Bath Ashton streams. Yeah, actually that's true. We didn't play all of the Arkham games, but I think I have them all. We need to find them access to them all in some way.
can't get KFC delivery because um, because like, I'm going my left for this month, and also because um, because I have food in the house. I have to be good and not eat all the crap that I want to eat all the time because I have to be good and try and be healthy sometimes. And also, my boyfriend doesn't like KFC as much as I like KFC. I mean, he will get it. When we were driving back from um, Leicester the other day, we drove back and got KFC and I was aghast. We've got KFC in the services. It was really good, actually. Um, I want chili dogs, so I'm too lazy to make them. Ooh. I mean, I understand being too lazy to make them because that doesn't like it requires some effort. But uh, you should make them because they, that sounds nice. If you have all the ingredients, you just gotta, just gotta commit to it. You just gotta just say, hey, gave me out the trap. It's me, gave me out the trap. We're gonna make some goddamn chili dogs right now. Prepare yourself. Here it comes. We're doing some cooking. Where are these last five things? Cowards. We got a like wrap of the day thing that they do. We got one that was, it's the supercharged mayo one and I bloody love it, all right? I don't like mayo, but I like the supercharged mayo. It's nice and I like it. I've got some sweet chili bite things to do. Oh man, oh, I'm so hungry now. <laughs> Everyone stop talking about food. Or I'll get Mardi. Damn it, I'll do it. I'm glad. You you make those goddamn chili dogs the best goddamn chili dogs anyone's ever eaten in their whole life. You hear me? I also do not like mayonnaise. However, I like the supercharged mayo that they have because it doesn't taste like mayonnaise. It's spicy and it doesn't even have a hint of mayo. They could just call it supercharger sauce and I'd be like, yep, yeah, cool. They have to put the word mayo in it to make me feel bad about myself. Taking such a hard start on not eating mayonnaise. Left, right, left, right, left, right. I still haven't found this last couple things. Sad, man. Sad. I bought a four pack of Kit Kat Chunkies earlier and they did not last an hour. I mean, Kit Kat Chunkies are elite. My nan always used to have Kit Kat Chunkies in the house whenever we go over to her house and I'd be like, mm, Kit Kat Chunky time. Time for a Kit Kat Chunks. I love a Kit Kat Chunky. I really like the peanut butter one they did as well. I love peanut butter. Well done, Mil Milo Dane. I'm very impressed. Let's go inside the tunnel leading to the crystal and add this component to the machine without further ado. Kit Kat Chubkies. They're like fat Kit Kats. Kit Kats are like little... I don't know if you have Kit Kats in America. Do you guys have Kit Kats? I don't know. I just assume you're American because uh, Chili dogs is a very American thing. Um, yeah, they're like they're fat Kit Kats, pretty much. Fat Kit Kats. You do. Oh, good. You're not completely deprived then. You're deprived of a lot of things. I'm glad you're not deprived of a, a Kit Kat. Um, yeah, they're basically just rather than being like four in a pack, you have uh, one big Kit Kat, and, and they're like layered up. Large boned Kit Kat. Yeah. I'm going to the market. Kit Kat Chunkies, man, they're so good. And then they've released them, uh, they released the peanut one, and I think I had an orange one briefly. But man, Kit Kat Chunkies are so good. Congratulations, Milo Dane. Thank you. Yay! Kit Kat's on Nestle. Oh, that's true, yeah. I forgot America has Nestle. It's, it's Cadbury, isn't it? Though sometimes there is things that we talk about that you guys don't have that are Nestle. Big ones. You used to get a Kit Kat Big Cat every day after work because the vending machine had them. Mm. So you know we got a, like a big giant Kit Kat cup, not Kit Kat, peanut butter cup um, for the tap heel. I've been looking at that the last few days and I'm like, 
Maybe it's time to eat that big bloody peanut butter cup. So I might have that tonight. Try Reese's with the big Reese's with pretzels in them. My God, that's a thing. Oh, that sounds good. So I kept them aside for you. Call it a welcome present. A third bubble, triple bubble. Triple bloody bubble. These bubbles should help fix it. If we're going to plan, you should be able to glide for longer. The big funnel is in Foliana Heart Heights, the heart of the Mantis territory. Putting together a list of all the snacks I'm going to send in a tap heel. Man, like, I just like love peanut butter things. Not a big fan of chocolate, but I do like sweets. I like Sour Patch Kids. Um, I like sour sweets. You know those tubs, I don't know if you saw them, they're like toxic waste tubs. I've had one of those on my desk since um, the tap peel and I've been gradually like eating. And I think they get more sour the longer you leave them because um, they're more sour now than they were when I first opened them. I've only got one left now. Oh, tweet me a picture of, the, of Alyssa rocking the jean top. Oh my God, to be fair, that is horrible. That's horrible, that is. Yeah, no, that's terrible. Actually, it kind of looks more like a skirt. Like a mini skirt. Well, she's pulling it off, but it's horrible. Bomb style Mexican candy I love called Sal Spaghetti. Oh, I've heard of that. Ooh, Sal Spaghetti. Oh, man. Definitely try that. The Swift on it. Yeah, I think they start melting. I think you're right. And race the arrow bubbles until you've reached the finish line. Make capable fellow fast too, even if you can be more aerodynamic. Give me something to help me clear the course and try them out. Let's have one of each area in the house. A great race, which I'll handle, and a small one handled by Dash. I'm Dash, second bosses hornet in the house. Come see me and try and get the best times in my races. Do you get good enough times in the small or great races? You can win medals and outfits. Outfits. Oh my god. Outfits. Is this the designer? Iconic. Okay, right. Um, there is a lot of good food out there. Out there. There's lots of good food I want to try. Do you know what I really want? I really want us to get more fans in Korea so that people can like send me some Korean snacks and stuff. That's what I really want. Especially like ramen. Just love it, man. Just love it. Oh, I'm so hungry. Whenever I do these streams, I definitely need to start like bringing like second lunch with me because I always eat my lunch at 12. And that normally, like by the time I get home at like half six, I'm like, oh God, it's time to eat. But then suddenly it's like seven o'clock and I'm like, oh, I'm so hungry. How do I do a race then? Do I have to go to an area? Is that what I said? Yeah, maybe I'll get some cup noodles. I don't really like cup noodles. I like ones that aren't like pot or cup noodle branded. But I haven't had a pot noodle in a while. Yeah. Oh. I accidentally skipped past that thing. Not as very welcoming. Getting the big fun on the photo hunt will not be easy. La last news I had it was a possession of the mantis named Off Rocker. We can always try to negotiate. Oh, we're back in this area. Where's the race? Oh, there. Let's go try and do one of these races. I don't think sober are good. I have those. Those are the ones I like. I like sober and I like to make the um, mi goreng indomie noodles. Those slap Richard as well. Wait, what that? Oh, it's all the way over there. I was tricked.
beat Fallen Order last night, so now I'm booting up Tales of Arise. Oh, nice. I am um, still playing Fallen Order. Slowly but surely getting through it. I keep getting distracted by other things. As is, you know, completely out of character for me. I'm normally really focused on what I'm doing. Shin ones are good too, but that's also good. Oh, damn it, it's all over there. Yeah, there probably is those subscription boxes, but they're quite expensive. And I'd be worried that I would get ones I wouldn't like. There was one, there's a an Asian supermarket nearby that I've been to once or twice. I've ordered, I've got some like random ones to try. But the issue is that all the instructions are like in Korean or Japanese. And I don't know what they say. So it's kind of like figure it out from like context clues, you know? <laughs> yes, let's do a race. Wait. I was trying to use the Google Translate app, but it wasn't. Oh. There. Hey, Batman found through. How's it going? Oh my god, how the hell are you meant to do that quicker than that? Damn it. I'm gonna have to do it again, aren't I? Can I do it again? Oh, baby. Yeah. Platinum medal. How quick have I got to do it then? 25 seconds. Oh, that might be too hard. That might be a step too far for me. Go quicker, bloody gremlin. No. Beat my previous time. Damn. Damn. No thanks. Actually, no, I'm good, thanks. Thanks though. We're gonna go do the other one now. So we can get gold medal in it. Let's see if we can find this last plat this last Holland while we're around because I can't like find it. You. Oh my god, there they are. That's the last Pollens. There they are. Get them for me. Yes! We've got all the Pollens. So proud of us. Yes, I'm ready. Um, excuse me, what the hell is that about? Help. 
One minute? That's long for a race. A longer bloody race. can shave 12 seconds off that time. Do I not even get a medal? I'm out here. We'll try again later. We'll try again later. Whoops. Let's go to the next area. Is this the cat flap? Go into the next area. Boyfriend needs a wee and he's outside. I have to give him the code because he's stuck outside. I need to wee really bad. He's just driven from Leicester. That's three and a half hours. That's a long drive. You shall not pass. I'm going to get that. That's going to be mine. Fish tools and change the bars of the. For inspection, I wouldn't tell you nothing about where I hid the key in the bottom of the big vivarium. Well, I'm going to get the key. That's coming with... Oh, I forgot about all the clairs! Yay, more clairs. More clairs, and we get more Terrences. Get the whole gang. Everyone's going to be here. Everyone's going to be friends. It's going to be great. The green tiny king are following you. Holding R2 can come in handy. Oh, my God! What was these guys' vibe? <laughs> Ladder. Larry. Let's go, Larry's. Yay. Larry's and Claire's. What we've currently got. got some Larry's and some Claire's. I wonder if we'll get any chances. We must be. I'm going to carry those for the current. Free those Larrys. Free those Larrys. Let's stop people doing this. Oh, they keep doing it. I don't have to stop them from doing it. <laughs> I don't know if I don't know if a bastion is on the same level as uh, as vidiots. You know, I appreciate you thinking that we. <laughs> We could we could even stand the charts. Oh no, not you guys. I want my boys. Larry's, the Larry's. 
Oh, the Larrys. We've not got enough Larrys. Find some more. Some more over there. More Larrys for the pile, please. You never have too many Larrys, you know. I wonder how big I can stack these Larrys. If I had 15 Larrys, and each Larry was one centimeter tall, how many Larrys would I need to climb a meter? Ooh. Can we go over the wall? We can. I'm in. Suck it, losers. Can't keep me out. I've got the goddamn Larrys on my side. I have God and Larry on my side. There's some bloody... Where are the Terrences? That's what I want to know. I can hear Owen and Jack shouting next door. Something good happening for football, is it? Good football stuff happening. Bloody losers. Does anyone know how I, the, the, I make the boys stop being a ladder? Because I don't know how to do that. number of Larry's that is a lot I can't I don't know how many Larry's we have imagine playing football manager I know imagine, imagine being such losers bloody losers I'm not talking to anyone I'm just doing my own thing who's vibing where the vibe takes me, you know? Let's see the whole bag. Matriarch of Roli Foliana, Ridmi told me about you. Interesting bombix. One of the buttons whistles and calls them back. Every time I do it, they just build a new ladder. A new, oh, it's X. Oh no, triangle. Triangle does it. Hmm, interesting. Oh my God, they've encou Owen's encountered Ben. <gasps> Uh-oh, a danger. Bag. You're being weird and creepy back here. I'm going to offer you my advice. Be kind to the snails here. They're more slimy than they are wordy, but the masses believe them to be an important spiritual role model. Okay, respect the snails. I can do that. I kind of like snails. They're kind of weird little dudes, eh? Oh, I haven't got any Terrences. They're so annoying. I just miss my boys. I miss my lads. My Terrences. My Terrence of Terrences. They're all gone. Whee! I love when they just make noises. I love them. I love them so much. They're my best friends. Release those Larrys! Right, come on, Larrys. We're gonna bloody figure out what we have to do. <gasps> Some Terrence is over there. I would like to make a game where you play as an aide to a politician where I have to shred as much evidence as possible while the police or investigators catch you. Oh my god, not UK government simulator. 20, 2023. Put political humour there for you everyone, hope you enjoyed it. 
That's something you did. Something probably were like, shut up. Do you understand it? We're from America. What are you talking about? British humour. We don't get it. Joke is that our political system's a mess. So proud. Come on, Terry's. Welcome. These are Larry's. Do you like the Larry's, Terry's? Terry's, are you enjoying the Larry's? They are our new friends. The Larry's. They are our besties. <laughs> How many bloody Larry's we've got? So many goddamn Larry's. It's crazy. do I need for this? Oh, I've only got six. Oh, I fell. My boys! My boys! Real men eat their incriminating evidence. Down straight. If you can't eat it, you shouldn't have made it. That's what I always say. A family motto. If you can't eat it, you shouldn't have made it. Stand by that. Forever. Right, so we're going up here then. Oh, do we find what we've got to deliver these letters to yet? Or did I make that up? It's over here. with Terence to do around here? I can't remember. Terence, did you find anything to do? I think there was. Wait, snails? Treat them with respect. Treat that snail with respect, so help me. Do you want to do that arm? No, me neither. Me neither, homie. You don't know have to do with this arm. So I have to do this arm? I don't. Be nice to know. Can anybody like a, an arm? A hand? Can I want a hand? <laughs> yes. see like an American show um, and like it's from an English version of the show and if you were like oh they've made an American spin-off I'll watch this and then you're like oh it's literally like word for word the same as the first series and it's not until like the second series that they like find their own like ghosts for example it wasn't exactly the same it definitely changed a bit but it's like funny seeing like the things that happened in the original 
British version, version even, in the American version because it's like, hey, I remember this from before, from the from the before times. Yeah, The Office was like that. The first series like doesn't land because it's such a direct copy of like the English version that like I don't think Americans liked it and the English were like, well, we've already got that. Why do we need it again? Oh yeah, Little Britain USA. What was the other one? Uh, In Between Us. That went that was down well, didn't it? See, I've never really got into things like The Office. I just, the like cringe comedy of things like The Office just makes me feel so uncomfortable that I can't watch it. Oh my God, look how many guys have got. So many bloody Claire's and Terrence's and Larry's. That's such a big gang. Right, found the place for the arm. God, look at the gang, yeah. Even we've got so many Claire's, we might have more Claire's than anything else. Oh no. Yeah, we do. We've got loads of Claire's. Oh, there was a US Red Dwarf, was there? Was it good or was it how, how it normally goes when you port an English show to America? Grab that. Bring it back to the frog. Maybe, maybe frog. I don't know if it was a frog. Travesty. Tragedy even. Travesty not the right word. Pam's saying she's holding in the baby so they don't have to get charged for two nights at the hospital. She had a week off to recover from having a baby. Horrifying. Yeah. I quite like Parks and Rec for a while. Um, I watched quite a lot of that when I was in uni. I think I watched like, the first few series of that. And I always see like edits of Parks and Rec and I'm like, man, I wish I could have got more into it. But it just did that thing that like the office and everything that was similar to the office did where they're like, ooh, something, something goofy's happened, time to look at the camera. So I do like though, I like Abbott Elementary, which also does the same thing, but uh, I just like it. I think it's good. But you know what? I think it's great. There, I said it. They've only put season one on the um, on Disney Plus at the moment, which is sad because season two is out and I want to watch it, but I don't want to stream it legally because I want to be a girl and like, support the creators and stuff. But, uh, that's true, The Office probably did make fair fair bit of money, so it's an understatement. It made mad money. So now our refrigeration needs to be problematic and no one cares. Because he's so funny. What do you mean he's transphobic? But he's so funny. How can he be transphobic? How can he be problematic? He's so funny. And he made my favorite TV show ever, The Office. So funny. <laughs> he sounds a bit. 
I detached three. Hey, we have to make four of that. I too can't stand the digital base. He's so funny. You're just not smart enough to understand his comedy. Justin Roiland, he's so funny. You just don't get it. You're just not smart enough to understand. Okay. Well, maybe I don't want to be smart enough to understand the jokes because I think jokes are just Don't like them. leave it there for now because I will just keep playing this all night I will keep playing this all night so we're gonna leave it there for today um, and come back to it next week because I really enjoyed this game my, ma my mouse isn't dead it's not dead I've really enjoyed this game and I hope you guys have too um, Am I speed running it? I'm playing it. Am I playing it really fast? I'm just vibe. I'm just vibing. I'm just feeling the energy, feeling the rhythm, feeling the rhyme, feeling the beat, and we're lost in time. Um, I'm having a great time. Um, yes. So we'll play some more of that next week. Tomorrow we're streaming more Callisto Protocol. A list went out today. It's the ten best video game D makes. It's my list. I should know. Uh, just a hashtag girl gamer. Can't help it. Um, so check that out, um, there's a ranked list coming out this weekend, and I think it's the worst game of the week as well, so check that out as well. And yeah, uh, not sure there'll be a stream on Friday from James on Twitch, but there'll definitely be one on YouTube tomorrow. And yeah, that's about it. So thanks for hanging out with me. See you later, like, like yeah? Alright, actually, yeah. Alright, bye.